Mix. I've got to say, there is quite a story playing out at the Chili Bowl. Two local drivers, one from Bixby, the other from Sand Springs, took the checkered flag on the first two nights of the Chili Bowl. Cannon McIntosh and Hank Davis have been friends since they were kids. And then Saturday night, they will be competitors once again. Hank and Cannon are with us this afternoon to talk more about their big wins this week. First of all, guys, congratulations. Thank you. Thank and you. thanks for making time to come and talk to us today. Thanks for having us. Yeah, it's okay, so be... let, let's start here, Cannon. What went through your mind as you crossed the finish line? Um, it was definitely exciting. Um, not only just winning, but also kind of getting it out of the way and, uh, you know, locking ourselves into the big show on Saturday. and. Um, you know, that's kind of the hardest part at the Chili Bowl is not putting yourself in a bad position and taking yourself out early in the week. And, uh, you know, you want to be able to make it as far forward as you can um, come Saturday night. You know, if you, you know, finish towards the back, you, you could all be buried all the way to an E-Main. And if you don't even make your prelim feature, you could be buried even more than that. So I think just getting it out of the way and, and uh, locking ourselves in was the biggest thing. Now you can focus on Saturday. Yeah, that's the big yeah. night. Uh, Hank, you have a special story from last night. Um, you know, we had it written in here, a surprise one, not necessarily a surprise for you. That was your goal the entire time. Was a surprise. <laughs> so what went through your mind when you crossed the finish line? Uh, a lot. Um, obviously, Cannon has been in this spot before. Yeah. Um, it was pretty neat, though. Uh, I was pretty much just left speechless. I didn't really know what to say, um, but no, it was pretty neat. I think it's so exciting. And so the other part of it, you guys have been, y'all are lifelong friends. Y'all have been racing together really since the start. What is that like being able to get behind the wheel? Y'all are gonna be together again on Saturday. I think it's really cool. Uh, I root for him when I'm not racing 100% all the time. Uh, but no, I think it's gonna be pretty cool. We know that, I know I, he's gonna race me really clean. I'm gonna race him really clean. Um, so I don't think there'll be any problems and I wouldn't mind uh, duking it out for with him. I love that. So what does it mean? Y'all are both hometown guys and y'all are getting to race in the Chili Bowl. This is a really big deal. Uh, what does it mean to y'all to be able to do this in your hometown? Um, it makes it just a little bit more special, uh, especially to be able to stand on the stage and um, celebrate something like that. Uh, you know, I feel like we both grew up watching at the Chili Bowl as kids and um, seeing really great names come through there and, and um, just show dominance. And, um, and now we're able to kind of compete with those guys and and uh, just show what, what talent uh, some Oklahoma drivers bring to the, to the table. And, um, you know, to be able to duke it out with some of the best um, to ever do it is pretty special. Um, you know, I grew up watching the Swindells dominate in that building and, and uh, Kyle Larson, Christopher Bell, uh, and just see, you can see how far they've gone. Um, you know, they're both cup drivers in NASCAR now. And uh, to be able to compete with them the last couple of years um, and, and be close in the fight to, to now, you know, being one of the contenders is special. Absolutely. Hank, what's it mean to be racing at this level at home? Yeah, uh, it's really big. I never thought, I've never really, this is stuff you only dream of for yeah. uh, for some people. Um, I never thought it would come. Um, so for here, here, here on out, everything is a plus. Um, of course, I want to do really good, but uh, I made the feature. So uh, yes. it's kind of made my year so far. Um, but, you know, a, a good finish would make it even better. Absolutely. Well, guys, thanks so much for making time. And you've got so many people rooting, rooting for y'all. And we've heard so many great things about the Chili Bowl and how fun it is. So Thank good you. luck this weekend. Thank you.